Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this video, let me show you how to transfer your Google Photos to iCloud Drive. Now you can go ahead and do this from your phone, or you can go ahead and do this on your desktop or your PC. You will be following the same tutorial by basically downloading your Google Photos into somewhere and then uploading it into iCloud. In terms of your mobile device, it is a lot easier where you can just go ahead and select the actual images themselves and then just download it into your device. It will automatically save it into your photos on your mobile phone. And if you have your iCloud sync open or turned on, then it will automatically save it to your iCloud. Now in this tutorial, let me show you how you would do the same thing, but on your desktop. So what you would need to do is to go ahead and go into photos.google.com where you can go ahead and log into your account and then just go ahead and search for the images that you want to go ahead and transfer over to your iCloud. Now this can be very you know, small images like this or it can be multiple images that you can go ahead and do. If it is small images or you know just a relatively minute number of images you can literally just go ahead and select them and then you can go ahead into the top right right here and then click on download so you can go ahead and download this straight into your hard drive itself before uploading it into iCloud or if you have multiple images what you can go ahead and do is to use takeout google takeout so what we need to do is to go into takeout that google.com where we can go ahead and download all of our data. Now, this usually allows you to download everything that you have done with your Google service, which is automatically selected. What you need to do is to just go ahead and deselect this right here. And then we're going to go ahead and search for Google Photos right here. So go ahead and take this right there. And then we're going to scroll all the way down until we can go into the next step. Now you can go ahead and select in terms of how you want this to be downloaded. So you know you either want to get this download link sent via email to Drive, Dropbox, OneDrive, or Box. You know I'm just gonna go ahead and choose email right here, and then just go ahead and select the frequency. So since we're only gonna be doing this once, I'm just gonna click on export once. It's also recommended to just keep this into a zip file right here. And then you can go ahead and select in terms of the file sizes itself. So you have set this into a maximum of two gigabytes. So if the number of images is a lot larger than that, then it can split it into multiple files. And there you go. Now go ahead and click create export. And then Google will then go ahead and copy the data from Google Photos into a downloadable link where then you will go ahead and get an email from them. Now, once that this has finished exporting, you should get some form of email. So just go ahead into your uh, email itself. And then as you can see, it is right here. It says that your Google data is ready to download. So you have an email from Google Takeout. Go ahead and open this up and then just go ahead and click download your files. And then of course it will go ahead and verify if this is you and then just go ahead and sign in. Now you should be able to see this. So just go ahead and download the detail itself. It will open up a new file explorer. So just go ahead and save this. So that will be the first step. It is for you to go ahead and download your photos right here. Now, the next thing that we need to do is we need to go ahead and unzip this. So go ahead and right click. And then, you know, if, if you can find extract all, go ahead and do so right there so we're just opening up our images our folder right here so when we go ahead and see it it should be these ones as you can see we have managed to download them and then now that we have downloaded our images we're going to go ahead and go into our icloud so go ahead into icloud.com right here and then you should be able to see something like this where we can go ahead and go to our photos right here. So go ahead and open this up. And then 
this is where all of our iCloud photos are stored. Now for us to go ahead and upload our photos, all we need to do is to click on this right here, upload, and then just go ahead and select the pictures themselves right here, and then click on open. Now this will go ahead and upload the photos, which was from your Google Photos. And there you go, you would have uploaded this, this into your iCloud Photos. And there you go. I hope that you have found this tutorial useful. Well. See you guys next time.